Here is a real quick explanation for universal laser users on the difference between PPI, which is your pulses per inch, and LPI, which they refer to as image density, which is actually your lines per inch. Pulses per inch does not affect your raster graphics. It only affects your vector graphics. So basically it's saying, if I draw a line an inch long, I'm gonna get 10 pulses in that line, so I should get 10 dots. If I, ch oh, I'm looking at the wrong one. We are looking at blue because that's the vector I used. So if I run 10 PPI, I will get 10 dots per inch. If I run 25 PPI, I will get 25 dots per inch. Um, if I run 100, I'll get 100 dots per inch, and that's when you start to see a solid line. Down on these bottom graphics here, the two left ones were both run at 100 PPI. The second from the left is just a little bit um, slower speed. That third one is run at 10 PPI, which is 10 pulses per inch. And then the fourth one is run at 25 PPI. So as you can see, that's a good way to do something like make perforated paper or something like that. Um, you can also mess with this setting if you're cutting acrylic and want to polish the edge a little bit more. If you just go a little bit higher, you won't get that perforated edge sometimes you see on the edge of acrylic. Now, image density is how many lines per inch. So this top graphic here that I did, the very top one was at image density one, which correlates to 83 lines per inch on a universal laser, and it was done at PPI 10. And that second from the top was also done at image density one, and the PPI was 1,000. I just want you guys to see that there's absolutely no difference in those two. Now the second set of blocks, the top one was done at image density five, which on a universal correlates to 500 lines per inch and it was run at PPI of 10 and then the very bottom block there was also run at image density 5 and PPI 1000 and as you can see again there is no difference in depth no difference in color my plywood's a little bit messed up so it's doing some weird things but definitely no difference in power on those two settings so again PPI is um, pulses per inch and that deals with vector graphics and you can use that for cool dotted line effects and perforations and image density is your lines per inch um, which you only have seven setups one is 83 lines per inch two is uh, 200 lines per inch three is 250 four is 333 five is 500 six is a thousand and seven is two thousand Hopefully that helps explain that a little bit for you guys.